Hello, it's time for the Tango Baldy Show. I'm gonna not have a cup of tea today. I'm gonna have a coffee, a cappuccino. I have a surprise for you. I found some very lovely balloons. Very lovely balloons in Poundland, my favorite shop. And they're called Extra Long. Who never wants an extra long balloon? Be very careful with the kettle. I wondered why that took nearly an hour to boil. It's filled to the very, very top. Oh. So there is my cappuccino. Especially when it's um, packaged up. Balloons. Let's get a bit more comfier. Oh, my leg is stinging. How's this? Let's pop the camera up a little bit more. How's that? Beautiful. So these are 15 balloons, long pack. Use a pump to inflate. That's not happening. Let's get a yellow, look at that, <laughs> yellow balloon. They're not, they weren't messing around they weren't, when they were saying extra long. Someone says I have to stretch my balloons more, so let's stretch them. This is stretched. They look to me like the caterpillar balloons without the caterpillar things. And being as they're pound land, they're very, very thin. Can you hear the Angus cows in the background? Oh. So at night time you hear the Angus cows and you hear the Muntjac deers, they're kind of like bah, bah. And there's herons, there's so much stuff here have a balloon tree. Well we get 15 done. That should look a bit better. Go for a blue one. So 
So I found going to Great Yarmouth drivers to be absolutely crazy. I think because they're probably on holiday a lot of people. But the, I always thought the driving where I lived was bad. But yeah, it's been quite dangerous. People trying to run us, literally on purpose, run us off the road on our motorbikes. We saw a motorbike accident earlier and someone tried to push us off the, my motorbike with their car just near where the accident happened. It's like people are just crazy. But yeah, when we drove here, rode here, I would say, it was absolutely chucking it down. You can't see me behind, but there's a whole washing line of clothes behind us. And thankfully, as we're going home tomorrow, which will be um, Wednesday, all the clothes are going to be dry. We won't be riding home in wet clothes. I'm not very good at tying these knots up and looking at you lot. But this is a relaxing balloon video. We have no orange balloons. Big spider. Before I go, I'll give you a quick tour of the campsite as well. You get, um, it's not like a normal campsite. You pay £10 a night per person and you get like a huge area to yourself. So we'll do that. And you can see my washing hanging on the line as well. Where can I tie that one? Let's do that one up there. Never had a balloon tree before. Why is they all sticking out the back like that? Some people were born on the wrong side of the bed. Are you enjoying this video? Maybe I'll have a little cup of coffee. Ooh. Wow, that is still roasting hot. Let's have a little more, uh, <coughs> more milk with the bugs. They're hiding in the froth. You hear the train?
yeah, coffee's all right. Not the best, not the worst. Sometimes when I make videos that are quite long like this, I think they're really boring. But then when I watch them myself, late in the evening, I find them quite calming. How can we tie that? Let's try, I'm running out of tying on bits. Let's do it there then. Let's go around the back for the last few. Listen to the pigeon. That stopped it. one isn't that a count a country Fifteen balloons is a lot. gonna try that another video after this which I tried in hitching but I forgot to press the record button where these are all gonna magically inflate on their own
Thank you for watching the Tango Baldy show. I really hope you enjoy seeing these lovely balloons being inflated. Don't forget to tune in tomorrow, if that's what you call it nowadays, to watch the self-inflated, self-inflating magic balloon tree. Let's have a quick tour around the camp for some bonus content. Over there is a lovely fire pit. And that is the view that you can see in the evening and watch the sun go down. Over there, over there, is a rope swing. No, it's not. It's a chair swing. So there is a toilet. And this is the campsite that I'm in. And this path leads down to another campsite down there. It's quite a long walk. So you get all this area here to pitch up in and we have a washing line because it was raining. This is my son's tent, but I would say my tent. This is where he camped last night, but he was on a bit of a hill and he kept rolling down the hill in this night. Um, that's my tent. We have a little fire bucket. And then you have our little fire pit and the balloons. All of this is for us to sit and camp in. It's lovely, all to yourself. And there is my tent with my bedroom. And yeah, around the back. That's your bonus content.